Hi, I'm Joseph Albert, Editor-in-Chief of the American Journal of Medicine, and I'm here to talk with you about what I thought was a particularly interesting article uh, in the May issue of the AJM. And now, I have a conflict of interest here. The author, sole author, um, is one of uh, our faculty members um, in, in your par uh, Partha, um, uh, one of our primary care internists, um, and she's originally from India. And uh, she approached me some months ago and said, you know, there's a lot of special issues when taking care of patients um, from South Asia. That's India and Pakistan, Nepal, Sri Lanka, and Bangladesh. Uh, you know, that, and of course, there's a number of different religions. There's the Buddhists and the Hindus and the Muslims and the Jains and so forth. They said, and each of these groups have different cultural aspects that make their interactions with the doctors different. And, and I've experienced that, um, you know, where, where uh, uh, sometimes it, it, we have an Indian patient with an acute MI and the, taking care of them is different from taking care, you know, of somebody born here and raised in Tucson. So um, uh, she wrote this really, I thought, superb review article that points out for physicians taking care of um, South Asians that these are some of the issues, you know, that, that you're going to have to deal with. Of course, cultural um, and, uh, and also expectations, you know, about the doctor and, and uh, expectations about when, they when they're in the hospital. Um, I, I thought it was a, a really very good. And of course, uh, you know, there are a number of dietary restrictions that are different for these groups. So you need to be aware of those things. Um, and uh, it was just a very, very, uh, I thought, fine article. It turns out there are now 5 million South Asians living in the United States. When I was in medical school, I don't remember even one person in Boston, you know, who was uh, from South Asia. But of course, recently, there's been a tremendous influx. And of course, it's it's high tech people, people, engineers and software folks and so forth. Um, and they've, uh, you know, established themselves uh, very well here in the U.S. We have a number of residents and docs in the community and so forth. So I think it is interesting, um, other than just visiting your local Indian restaurant, I think it is interesting and important uh, when you're taking care of patients to be aware of um, these uh, uh, factors that that um, uh, uh, Dr. Partha points out. It's an excellent, uh, excellent review article. Um, so I hope you'll all, all read it and think about it. Um, I'm sure you're going to have lots of experiences with South Asians in your practices. Um, and uh, I hope you'll read the rest of the fine articles in that issue. Um, always happy to hear from you if you have comments uh, and uh, look forward to talking with you again uh, next month.